Hey there, everybody. Fett here, and welcome back to Fett Plays Oxygen, not included. We did it quite a bit last episode, actually. We got this place all good and insulated. Got some. Gonna have some art up in here. We don't have it yet, but we will. We will. All right. To, excuse me if I sound a little bit weird. My uh, got a little bit of sickness. Still getting over it a bit. We're gonna dig down here and find out what this is, and. We're going to probably move this tepidizer, like I said before. In fact, let's deconstruct it now. And we'll just straight up build a new one down here. Because I think that is such, such a much, much better idea. So all we have to do is turn this bad boy over here. Check it out. Get us to, what is it under, utilities? Yep. It's still bigger than I thought it would be. Anyway. Heavy watt wire. Plop that up. See, we filter the water and then clean it down here. And then, and then, excuse me, we can use it for other stuff. It's so much better. It's actually ridiculously better. We have no research. That's fine. We are, oh, our algae terrariums are going to be uh, shutting down here soon. I need more water. We need more slime. These things are still pumping out water as quickly as they can. And we're grabbing it as quickly as we can as well. But it's a process, you see. It's a process that takes time. Got some popped eardrums going on down here. Probably because of this. That's okay. That's okay. We did cut this off. I kind of want to get farty up here. This guy right here is puffed because he makes slime. And I want slime. This dust cap is actually growing. It's pretty great. So you got some more carbon dioxide down here. Some chlorine. It's negative 22 down here. Holy cow. And yeah, if we can get all of this polluted water together. And pump it up. Basically to hit right to the sieve. We'd be in heaven. Yeah, that'd be great actually. So we'll see about doing that. All right, we have unlocked a new world. A world that is going to be filled with hydrogen here in a bit. Part of why I blocked this off, you see. Hmm. I suppose if I wanted to get fancy about it, I could just quickly build a airlock right here. Okay, this requires a sample to unlock. A sample of what? Submit a sample at an 8. I want to know what that does. Oh, hydrogen's already going up. We've done goofed it. To be fair, there's a lot of not breathable. We've opened it. What is this? A vending machine? You can rummage it for useful materials. Okay. To all from admin at gravitasfacility.nova on attended cultures for the health and safety of your fellow facility employees. Please do not store unlabeled bacterial cultures in the cafeteria fridge. Okay. I guess we'll rummage through it. Can we use the table? It is a table and some chairs. You are right about that. Can't really do anything with it though. Security door. A is some fresh water. And a lot of pinch of pepper nut seeds. Okay. This door cannot be manually controlled, but it's automatic, so we will open it anyway. Yeah. Okay. I guess that's cool. I guess we'll enable these for auto harvest since the temperature's good down here. Hmm. So it takes 88 cycles to grow by itself. But if we gave it some phosphorite and some polluted water by putting it in our own area, we could totally speed that up. Unfortunately, we don't have a place hot enough for that. I mean, it is 101 in this room. Because of the tepidizer. First of all, keep going, guys. The tepidizer. Dude, it's actually brilliant. I understand now. I do. 
is all algae. Oh my god, that is a lot of algae. Dude, we need this. Wait, do we need it? We don't need algae. We have eight tons of it. No, it's not the algae we need. There are other things that we need. Oh good, the uh, a lot of the hydrogen can just go up here. But yeah, with the tepidizer, we can warm up all this area, and then maybe we can create another farm? That and there's plenty of other ways to heat up your, your life. Heat it up with gas. Heat it up with heat. Just throw down a space heater down here. I mean, it's not the worst idea. Actually, you know, we put it over here. Hmm. Actually, I don't want to necessarily heat my battery room, so I tell you what we're going to do. We're going to block this off. There you go. And I think we're going to throw down the uh, pinch of pepper nuts in there. Does it matter what kind of air is in it? No. As long as the t pressure is between 150 and one. Excuse me, 10,000. And they grow on the ceiling, which is kind of weird, but okay. Hydroponic farm. Must be irrigated through liquid piping. Yeah. You can pump polluted water through it. Oh, you can... I see, you can turn it right upside down. I suppose we could use regular piping and just kind of throw water in there, but... Hmm. It's an idea. It's an idea. Might not do it, but we have a lot of those seeds now, so it's tempting. Okay. Let's dig. Let's get our Stay Puffed Marshmallow guy. Please. Dig it an eight. Let's go. Straight down here. Don't need this wild ladder. But thank you for your support. So we'll dig down to there. And once we release this boy, we'll uh, put a deodorizer, like, here and here. Someone over here is throwing out polluted oxygen as well. Anyway, that's not here nor there. We're at 20,000 food. It's not too bad, not too bad. The hydro fan doesn't have enough resources? I mean, I understand we're low on water, but why would we want the... We don't need that to have resources. Hey, we got some breathable oxygen up here and it's turning good it's beautiful okay so I want to harvest a lot of this stuff too we, we're kind of running both ways right now but this guy's gonna get us some slime and that's actually like very important in fact let's uh, maintain this dig down to the bottom so that we can walk down and collect the slime why can I not Oh, because of the dust cap? Yeah. We'll uproot that. Sleet wheat. As far as cold temperatures. Interesting. Yeah, it's, it gets really chilly down there. We're probably not going to explore that anytime soon. But we'll get this done. And then we will group this polluted water together and try to use it. And then... We will probably start heading up and getting a lot of this algae and stuff. Steam. You're bubbling up here? What's going on up here, boys? Sounds like some weirdness. Dude, we are so good on coal. We have 41 tons of it. And yet this thing still can't get powered. Nah, I'm kidding, because it's, you see, it's the batteries. They're, they have plenty of battery juice. What you put in the batteries, right? Battery juice. It's delicious. We do need to get some farms going, though. And this hydro fan actually needs to be turned on. So, uh... Let's... No, the hydro fan, please. Let's go ahead and enable it. Get some water in there. Cool it down in here a bit. Getting just a little bit too hot. Also, can we get our artiste in here, please? I appreciate the support. Is he right? Being the man we need him to be. Look at him go. He's also a little bit stressed out. Mainly because he's dirty. Oh, come on. You had it under for like a second. 
There you go. You're getting it down there. This is not cooling down this room enough. Dude, it is like so warm. Hmm. What if? What if? Hear me out. What if we get a thermoregulator? Pump the oxygen into that to cool it down. And then pump the oxygen back in here. How much power does a thermal regulator take? It takes 240 watts. Alright. I think this grid can take it. Yeah, I think this grid can take it. Let's pump that sucker up right here. Okay. Now, we need to look at our ventilation. So, oxygen goes in here. Cool. And then oxygen comes out. We just pump it straight up. Like so. Now we can't get it to go around there. Because of the height. So we'll just bring it around town. Right around here. I guess we're going to have to knock this thing. No, 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 no. Dude. Right there. Vent. Then we can just cancel this one. Okay. So you see how it's going to work. You understand? I'm sure you do. Let's do it. See if we can make this happen. This is reachable, right? Yeah, it's, it appears to be reachable for building. Not for digging. That's fine. How are we doing down here with our stay puffed guys? Well, it's all priority five, so we're not doing anything with it. I guess that's okay right now. Yeah, this will make the hydro fans unnecessary, I'm hoping. It is going to make it hotter elsewhere, like down here, literally. And it is very warm down here. It's these batteries, isn't it? It's these tiny-ass batteries. Pumping out all kinds of heat. Need to do something about that. But what? What? Also, there's polluted water, like, sitting right here. Let's, uh, mop that crap up. Mop this up, too. Might as well. Get it put in here. Life will be good. Let's, uh, also... I'm gonna put it at a priority 7, not a priority 8. Take out all this. Give us some more slime. It'll give us some gold, because why not? And we'll see what's going on to the left. Alright, we got most of it. It's rocking. Power seems to be good. Empty pipe. I got those backwards. He's done it. He's become an actual moron. Okay. I have to disconnect it from that? You gotta be kidding me. Oh no, I gotta deconstruct. Please. Save me. From myself. Okay. Let's try that again. Uh, yep. Uh, yep. Please. Save me from myself. I'm an actual moron. You're doing it. Come on, one more spot. Two more spots, it looks like. Someone. Oh, you know what? I didn't prioritize the rest of that. Yeah. Of course. There you go. All right. I just realized I should have been... This should all be insulated. I don't have insulated gas pipes. I need improved ventilation. Hopefully it'll still work. We'll see. So that's going to get hot in here. But the stuff going through the pipe should be cooler. I hope. Okay, see what's going through here. Gas pipe containing oxygen at 110 degrees? Dude, no wonder our base is getting so hot. 
Yeah, cool that stuff down, yo. Holy jeez. That's insane. How have we lived this long? All right. So, slightly cooler oxygen going in here. I think we're going to turn this back on for now. But this should help. I hope. Oi. The temperature of the pipe itself is still really warm. I think we are going to need to go with insulated piping soon. But the oxygen coming out is only 80 degrees, which is actually still warmer than... Oh no, that's, that's good! 80 degrees is just fine. This may actually work. Also, I feel like this thing is running very intermittently right now. Because we have people on the treadmills, that's why. They're keeping it powered, though. They're doing it. They're gonna be running all day. But they are doing it. And it's coming down in here. It's working. It's totally working. And that is awesome. Okay. Life's getting a little bit easier. Bobby, what's wrong? Soggy feet. Hungry. Popped eardrums. Well, you know... The shower and stuff's all usable. We got food. Not a lot of it, but we got it. Where are you? Are you, like, stuck somewhere? No, you're literally right here. Go eat some food! Don't even yell at me about this. I know the oxygen generation is not as sufficient as it could be. Alright, we got the algae distiller running. It's making us a little bit of polluted water at a time. I'm actually considering building a second one. I'm trying to think of a reason not to, and it's not coming to me why I shouldn't. So I'm thinking, maybe we just build another one, like, right here. Still some more algae. Well, you know what? I could do better than that. Let's build a platform. Like, right here. And we'll, this will be our algae distilling platform. Okay. There we go. That'll work. And then eventually we can mop this up. Or not. Or, or yeah, we, we can. We can. We're good. Please plant, plants grow. Please grow as well as you can. But yeah, it's down to 83 in here now. That's great! That's wonderful. I love it. These are not getting any advantage from these these paintings. Which is unfortunate. But I could put one over here. So they can at least have a little bit of art. Okay. Well that platform went up at no in no time, so next is the algae distiller. Which does take a little bit of power. Yeah, we're going to distill some algae. Alright, it does emit polluted water, which is good, because we want to emit that. Gives us algae. Puts out a little bit of heat, so it's going to be hot in here, so everybody take off your clothes. <laughs> That's right, we have to, uh, let's uh, actually, you know, get this done, too. Got lots of priority eights, because I'm kind of a dinkus. That's okay. That's okay. Kind of giving up on this for right now. We can open that up when we have more slime to work with. Right now we have 16 kilograms of slime. Ooh, there's another one down here. With ladders and whatever this is. Quite nifty. And we could get in right here through this igneous rock. Only we could cut through all of this hydrogen. And oxygen and other stuff. Was the bubbling I was hearing just the steam? Or was there actually something bubbling up here? I don't entirely understand. We'll figure it out in time. Anyway. Tepidizer? Tepidizer. Alright. 
is this draining the power grid? It is. But we want all this drained. So I kind of want it to keep going. Is the thing. So I guess I'm going to let it keep going for now. Oh my god, all of our algae terrariums have nothing to do. Okay. What's the plan? And we got this pumping water slowly. Okay. Let's get these connected. Because that's going to be a lot more water that we can work with. It's also going to be a lot on the grid. What's on this grid right now? It can handle 1,500 watts. It's at 600 right now. Yeah, it's not going to be able to handle all that. Mm. You know what? I'm going to do it anyway. Sometimes you have to be stubborn. So today, we're going to be stubborn. Okay. Those are good. Plumbing. Please, give me the plumbing thing. Okay. And, yeah. It goes right here. Beautiful. And this should all be priority eight. And we'll take care of it in the morning. Food's still not where I want it to be. I'm not entirely sure how I'm going to fix it yet. You going to eat that fruit there, little dude? You going to eat that, some of that fruit? All right, we got no power for this boy right here because it's only done with a manual generator. But you know what? I think for now, we're going to disable this. This is working. Temperature should stay relatively stable in here now. At least for a time. And we're still at insufficient oxygen generation. Whoo, we lost 185 kilograms. That's not good. Calorie generation was up, which is great. So how's our oxygen report looking? Yeah, we got a lot of rooms with a lot of carbon dioxide in them. Which the algae terrariums can take care of when we can use the algae terrariums. Hey, the heat's going up. Nice. Kill all you jerks. Okay. So I think if that's going to happen, we should deconstruct this in here. This is actually nasty. This room is, like, disgusting. But we're going to cut down some more of these uh, ladders. I'm going to just pump down to here. I'm going to do it. I'm a madman. You can't get... Oh, you can still get out of there. Okay. How much do we have to get rid of before we can actually put, like, a, a pump here? I'm going to have to get rid of everything here, aren't I? Hmm. I feel like it should be able to be placed here, but I think the pump itself is what's blocking us. I really don't like this room. <laughs> I feel like we should just have one ladder going down. Alright. No priority on that, though. Um, Man, we need more water. We could probably use this extremely hot water. But, oh, you know what? You know what? We have this water here. Why can't we collect that? Because of where it is. Hmm. It would take a lot of resources to pump that up, too. Okay, these all need slime now. We are out of slime. That didn't take long. That didn't take long at all. Okay. So let's get some more slime. There we go. Dig all that out. We'll uh, build a ladder so that they can get out. There we go. That'll get us some more slime going. Beautiful. 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 
Excellent. And they're all priority eight, which is actually good. And it's relatively breathable up here, although some of it's toxic. All right, now we got two of them pumping. This is good. That's more potential water. This is what I'm looking for. And this is going great now. Staying at a hundred and something. Okay. I think at this point, we just need to get water. So I'm going to throw down the pitcher pump here and probably regret it. We need to be able to use some of that water. Because right now, we need to get those algae terrariums running again. The distillers as well, but not to the same degree. Got some more food. That's great. The temperature in here is staying relatively stable, which I like. I like it a lot. Yo, let's get some of this algae poop. It's time. I also apparently turned this into, like, an automatic priority eight, but whatever. Okay, I threw down a lot of priority eights there. Probably too many, but we need this algae for this slime. We need his dew. I'm not proud of it, but it's the situation that we're in. And then after that... I think our next step is going to be to go to here. And then once we're there, we can do a ladder like this. And then we can use that to connect these into a single pool. Once these are a single pool, we could throw down a throw down a pump down here and get us basically into this polluted water area here. It's going to be one hell of a pipe, but it's what we need. And it's going to take time too, but that's all right. There's some breathable oxygen in here left. I'm surprised. Yeah, breathing down here is part of the problem. <laughs> it's a bit far for a lot of us. And we are getting this dug out, which I appreciate a lot. You know what? Let's put another ladder. Like that. Just so that we can make sure we dig all of that out. Because I don't know if it will be diggable all the way through for the entire time. But we'll find out. Yes, we will. You'll see. It'll be pretty darn great, won't it? Tiger Kitty. You know the deal. All right. Is this just a little pocket of polluted water? It is. I'm not a fan of that. This is going to go down here. Hmm. Yeah, but I don't want to move this down. I guess, you know what? It's probably a better idea anyway. Let's cancel all that. Dig like this. And then we're going to put in a airlock. Ooh, that's not going to work. Because once this goes in here, that's going to fill up, a, fill up a lot. All right. Figure this out, Bet. Let's go up. Like this. And then we'll ladder on down. Like so. Okay. That'll work. We'll even get a little bit of water out of it. Not that we need it. I mean, we do need it. Huh. What am I talking about? We really need water. Yeah, we can't reach this stuff. So it is good that I decided to do it this way. That works for me. Okay, good. Good to know. No water's being created. 
This scares me. Hmm. But we are pumping water out of here. So that does have all of our terrariums going at least. Which is going to suck up a lot of that carbon dioxide. So they do need to be running still. <laughs> Circuit overloaded. Okay. I understand this. I do. Might need to turn off this pump for now. Or, you know what? It's a, it's almost 200 degrees in here. We'll disable this for now. Ooh. It's nice and warm in there, isn't it? Yeah. Warm enough to kill all the germs, at least. Yeah. They'll be dead. That's more than hot enough. Plus, it'll make sure that the circuits don't overload anymore. So, I think that was a good move. Still getting this worked on. Down here, digging in a little bit this way, a little bit down. It's all going. I'll grab all this stank water. Probably even move it from over here down to here as well. Just to get it all in the one pool. And, oh, another security door. Thinking once we have all this pooled into one spot, we obviously are going to put the. Uh, Put the pump at the bottom. Find some damn way to power it. And then dig all the way up here and move it across to the side here. And in fact, we might just power it with this grid here. Because as long as the tepidizer's not on, this grid is fine. So, we might do it that way. The tepidizer definitely doesn't need to be on all the time. So I've noticed. Wheeze wart. Chilly breath. This respiration is having a cooling effect on the area. Dude, I need you to be here. <laughs> Are you like a living creature? You can be grown in flower pots. And they absorb heat by resp... Dude, I need this. You don't understand. I actually need this. I need it to be up here. To, like, totally replace this. That would do it. Anyway. Let's see how we did yesterday. Oh, God. The oxygen situation is not good. But everything else is looking somewhat all right. Food's a little bit lower than I wanted to be, but I think we're going to get that solved, too. Anyway, that's going to be it for this episode of That Plays Oxygen. Not included. If you enjoyed it, make sure to let me know by giving it a like. If you haven't already, feel free to subscribe for more. Thank you again for watching this episode of Thet Plays Oxygen Not Included. My name is Thet. Here is the Ragamuffin region. And we will see you in the next video.